Hello, and welcome back to some more Star Drive, when we last left off. Scrap! In this video, I am going to attempt to do things a little bit better, and hopefully clean up this clusterfuck that has seemed to happen. Um, my bank is now stable again, thanks to the loss of many of my capital ships and the maintenance coming down a bit, as well as increasing the tax, and hopefully I will continue to be able to drop the tax. However, we face another problem. We have all these ships, and I believe it is most ideal to scuttle them at this point, so taking a planet here will be uh, key, as these ships are not warp capable, essentially. So, uh, taking this planet, planet over is going to be a thing that needs to be done. And I'm not quite too sure exactly how I need to go about doing that. I think what I need to do is find a fillinator or build one. Perhaps, uh, I think I have one around here actually somewhere if I have not yet scrapped it. Um, perhaps I am wrong on that, that I do not have a fillinator sitting around. I do remember scrapping one that I had left on uh, standby, but, uh, yeah, I, oh, no fillinator, okay. That is fine. I'm also going to try something that I didn't. I am going to build another repair ship and attempt to repair, uh, my ships. I think I may know why they did not want to repair. And I am going to try something again. Hopefully whatever happens in this video, it is more... I, I do more than what... what uh, transpired in the prior one. Since not much was getting done. I do not believe these uh, three marines, as brave as they are, are going to be able to invade this planet by themselves. So like I said, I need to get a fillinator down here so that I can start fillinating that planet so that I may take it for for me. All of you guys need to turn the fuck around and orbit around here until this planet is taken in which I can scuttle you. Um, I am actually going to pause here real quick and I am going to turn all the sound off because I, I don't like the missile spam sound when I zoom in like that so I am going to be right back here mental gin sorry about that uh, people I am back and the sound is gone now that I can actually watch what some of this is what's going on down here without my computer exploding so all uh, positive things. All positive things. That is right. So, um, I see he's uh, warping in construction ships and more doom lotuses. Unfortunately, my my ships fighters have decided that they don't. They didn't. We you know they wanted to. Act like assholes and leave. So, I don't really have anybody. Oh, and the the assassins have decided that they don't want to chase that trade ship anymore, which is a relief. But I have an invasion fleet coming over here. That is another thing that. Uh, shit. <laughs> okay, you repair ship. You are going to go over here, and you are going to fly out to him again. And this time when you go there, I am going to lower the shields on him. And see if that does anything. And this god, this clusterfuck over here, needs to get resolved. Because while these carriers are pretty good... I mean, this is not an ideal situation I want to be in for uh, obvious reasons. So, 
that all needs to be fixed and rectified so that um, better actions can be taken in the future. Also, I am researching this. I, I guess I don't really need it again at this point. So I'm going to go actually and carry on to capital shields and other capital like items so that I can build proper capital ships that are properly defended so they're not getting their asses shot out anymore that would that would definitely be progress they're they're not losing their butts but I see other green is warping in more more ships though their attempts on that system is futile I will take it over even with uh with uh with uh, not very good ships over there that's all gonna be a thing so and okay you are here this time you are gonna go there and you there must be a reason why I can do this you're gonna turn your shields off will you repair him now with his shields off will you repair him I don't I don't think that is going to happen to be honest uh, also my planet here is being attacked I have planetary shields and stuff though so but uh, all these sh uh, these are bombers so and unfortunately my ships don't have hyperdrive but I think I might be able to send my warp rockets over here to do something so let's go ahead and send the warp rockets while my ship gets repaired please pretty please I will try this again okay you are useless to the max I don't don't know what other, what other things I can try I have I did try lowering the shields I took a guess that perhaps the shields might be what is limiting the ability to be repaired but I guess that is not the case um, Well, fuck. I was I was thinking here I was smart and I I have found the correct way to do things, but I guess I I didn't. That's a that's a shame. It's a shame indeed. That I do need some stuff from you. I think I am going to build um some warp rockets actually because they get around really fast and that is kind of what I need right now I need all these guys to play defense defense ch -ch defense ch -ch defense until everything can be scrapped hopefully these ships down here won't be be uh Hopefully those ships will get fucking scrapped when I get the goddamn... Oh, another invasion, please. Look at that. Look at this. You have so many invasion fleets because you own half the goddamn fucking map. Can you hurry this up? Don't have all day here. All of you. I can't give you guys all a global command. Now if I put you in your own fleet... No, at least not from here. Whatever, get out there and do something. Is there anything you? Oh, you are still building stuff though. Hmm. 
all the buildings are gone. Apparently that is the only thing that bombing is good for. No, I'm pretty sure it can damage um, planet population. It doesn't ever seem to uh, do that much. I mean, I had two filinators on the planet down here and it did not want to do anything, so I don't know. You jumped back. Why would you do that? Why why given an order to jump out would you jump back? Why? Why why are you guys doing this? I I can't even scuttle those subspace projectors. Why? Why are you guys not jumping? I don't get it. I'm getting really fed up with this. I I don't know if my game is bugged out, my particular one here, or if it is if it is just the the beta stuff. So I don't know if restarting a new game would would fix this. I don't really want to start a new one, but I don't know if I'm left any choice here. These, as nice as these subspace projectors are, they... And like you, why are you damaged? Again, I don't, I don't get. You have launched them on your own. Who did you repair? Who'd you try to repair? I guess on the bright side, the uh, the ship's gone. No, you don't need to do that. <sighs> I no, I can't build. I can't build capital ships. I need more technology before I can do that. This is a proven thing. I must acquire everything I need. And I'm... I need more money. This is, uh... This is most disheartening. To say the least. How... Frustrating... This all is, at times. You... Spaceport. Spaceport. Build everything you have. Do I have more people working on? I, I think I do. But I have more rockets. They are actually useful. No, they are not. They are trying to flee. Do not flee. Oh, you don't have that much ammo in you. You guys have ammo. Oh, you're the fu- Yeah, I gotcha. No, you guys, you guys need to scrap, 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 and you, okay, you want to go up there and scrap. I'm going to assume because this planet does not have the uh, buildings and stuff you require to scrap at. That's really fucking annoying, especially you guys. I shouldn't have built those fucking carriers.
what date am I on? 11.49.1 I... I'm really tired of this. I... I believe I have... I can't deal with the AI. It wants to do ridiculous things. It does not care what I tell my, my own ships. Don't care what I tell them to do. They want. They are so determined on getting resupplied that they don't understand that I want them around here to be scrapped because their carrier has been destroyed and I have no use for fighters. that can't warp I I give up I'm I surrender I'm not going to deal with this I, I give you everything I have I will come back right now And I am going to kill everything. I did not actually in the game for me. Maybe you did. There it is. My empire has fallen. Click to see the statistics. Oh, this is cool. Huh. This is pretty cool. So. So this is I'm going to start another game. In fact, I'll, I'll probably do it right here in this video. I'm going to put the difficulty on normal. No more carriers, no more no more capital ships until until I have all the technology I need. No more of that. I'm also going to change my color to red. So red. And what? I'm pretty sure there's a lot more green on this map than what's showing, but I, I'll just assume that's not in here. So, I, I'm no no more capital ships, no more carriers. <laughs> no, You're, I am done with this. I am new game. I am going to go here, and we are going to play on normal. And I'm going to get rid of all this crap. And I'm not. I'm not using no more carriers. Get rid of all this cybernetics, industrious. What else did I have? I had polluted homeworld. I had uh, tax increase. I think I had huge homeworld. Did I? I think I did. So what am I missing? Must have done something else as well. I think I had a two then. Did I have a? F I had a four ability somewhere, didn't I? Efficient. Ah, efficient. I was running out of taxes. I was running out of money. With, with. 25% reduction in my ship and building maintenance and 25% more taxes and I was I no more carriers you know what or, may, or maybe maybe less fighters being launched out that might be a, a better thing to do maybe less fighters I mean, yeah I mean, we can do that what color are you guys you guys are yellow that's kind of cool. Maybe I'll try different ships. Why don't I try a different race? You know, Wolf are cool, but... I want to try you guys. Get rid of all this stuff. Get exactly what I want. You can call me a bitch if you want to for quitting the game. I... I, uh... Fully expect somebody to say something like that. But, you know what? Just It just wasn't enjoyable at that point. 
I, 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 I admit I ruined it all myself. This is all my fault. I should not have tried to build carriers like that. I was assuming, I was thinking this game would be more Master of Orion like, and um, and I, I would be able to kind of build bigger ships pretty quickly and compensate later for the technology I did not have then in order to 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 build them appropriately with what should be required. I figured that I could build a capital ship and then eventually upgrade it and uh, you know make it make it great from there. But no, nope. This will be very interesting when the Volfar decide to use. Oh my! I have read that the enemies will use your ship designs. I'm not going to look forward to when they use my carriers and space. Whatever. So you're going to be yellow. It's a nice bright color, I guess. And uh, we have some cool shit. That's a cool thing. We still have the same racial bonuses, so this will kind of play out the same. Go ahead and get uh, get this stuff. Mm, I think I want to. Hmm. hmm. Yeah, see, those are the these are what I really needed. I need like a, uh, I guess I need a ship to carry both death spores and and um, nuclear bombs with. If I'm actually going to just wipe a planet out, I guess my my nuclear bombs just aren't good at killing people. You you would think they're <laughs> you would think they're good. You know, dropping. 47, what, 47, 46 nukes at a time? That's a capital hole. Oh, 358. Look, these guys actually have a Titan. I don't think the guys I was playing as a Titan, these guys actually have a Titan. That'll be fun. I'll actually get a Titan ship. I'll build it before I actually have what I need. And I'll fuck it all up, watch. But, okay. Um, so there's a few things I do need to design. Um, I think, yeah, I need a, uh, go ahead and load this, and I needed the colonizer, load, okay, whatever, and that, this is not, is this the colonizer? No, I don't think it is. I guess it is. I don't know why you have cargo space. Maybe you need cargo space. I don't know. We're going to replace its engines, though. And save as. Uh, warp colony. Ship. And I also need to make the freighter a warp freighter you guys actually only have 13 cargo space as opposed to two other ones that's interesting save as um, warp cargo ship okay and I think there's one more thing I want to do. I want to change my scout up here and do that. You still have like a normal thing. Yeah, you do. Okay. Nope. No, no, save. Vings is scout. Vings scout. Whoop. Vings. No one has uh, t uh, brought up about anything about um about um me doing all those uh, designs and stuff on 
on screen so I guess I, I'll kind of just wing it if I feel like doing it I will if I don't I won't unless anybody says anything about it but um, yeah no one said really anything about it so you know I, I guess these it might just be better to use normal scouts because I guess these scouts will warp there fast but that, I mean they still need to go to the planet but I'm not too sure exactly um, what's what would be better so go ahead and get uh, some more more cargo ships I don't think I can get rid of those either I don't think I can take the default ships out of here so build a couple of those and go ahead and put everything on production for now and we have the tech picks okay so yeah um, I guess we have an okay spot here I mean uh, it's not bad how's this over here that's not inhabitable so we got one planet it's not bad Need to orders and go exploring. And I guess this is the uh, little fighter they give me to start out with. I had it in the other one, but I didn't really mention it because let's see how fast these warp scouts go too. Oh yeah, they whole ass. Jeez. Cool. Also, so we so we got two rules here. Uh, well, three. Uh, don't build a capital ship until you have all the components necessary to build one extremely efficiently, effectively. Don't, don't. There's no. At least in my playthrough, there was no building a capital ship and then improving it as you tech things. Which is what I thought I'd, I'd kind of be able to do because even I mean even those fighters on easy were able to get through them. That is something that is a you know a, a thing that needs to be paid attention to. I mean those that was on easy and they got through it. So um, also the, the all those fighters really lagged my game up a lot and it's not good. So I'm gonna watch that. I don't have oh okay so we found our first guy. He is uh, down there. Okay, it's not bad. No more uh, subspace projectors either. That um, that seemed to kind of mess with the pathing of all my my ships. Build some colony ships there and get ready to start colonizing stuff. They seem to mess with the uh, ability for my ships to kind of jump around at their leisure. They seem to want to. Um, really go to a couple different places which is kind of a pain in the ass so um, I also seem to have I mean this system's okay do something there I guess all the systems with uh, with people at them are, are where I want to be so there's not very many um, And hostile forces. Hmm. Well, that's not that's not a bad planet there. Colonize that. I mean, three point two is not the greatest, but for population. But I just got a lot of plants around me. I need to fight people. I think I'm gonna try to just go to war immediately with uh, Gray down here and see what I can do. So he's got a large home world. It looks like, and he's already colonized this with his. Oh man, see. <sighs> That's what I needed, right there, and it's not something that I have. So, and you got everything out here. So let me go ahead and tech. Hmm. That has too much stuff. I mean, I could try to kill him, like immediately. And found uh, found green up there. I could I could try to like just send a bunch of troop transports over right now and see if I can ground invade him. I mean, he has good planets. That might be something I can do. It is early game. I'm. I'm gonna try to pull that off. 
I'm going to do it. So we can get that fourth one. And, uh, oh, there's the Volfar. I actually haven't talked to these guys because every time I play it, I've, uh, I've played as them so far, so. Um, very submarine looking like, like I thought it would be. It's pretty cool. It matches their submarine ships. Grrr! Okay. Negotiate. Discuss. Grrr. Why do you have to use such big words? We don't have problems with Corazines yet. Or Corazine. I don't know how to pronounce my people. But, dude, my ground soldiers are Ewok owl people with bazookas. And that's pretty cool. I like that. That's a cool thing. Um, I guess I can wait for the fifth. I don't know how many troops I'm actually going to need to try to go against this. I'm, I'm sure he's probably already got people on that planet. I mean, one, two... I mean that. Oh, that's a, yeah. That capital has twenty-five point things too. So that's kind of a thing. <sighs> I can colonize that. That's good hammers, but only point five on that. Ah, zoom out. Go ahead and export. Not that it matters that much for me right now. Is there anything like up here? Nope. Nope. Whoa. Uh, pirates. Yeah, leave me alone. Go away. Whatever. Anything up here? Um, 2.5, 1.7. You got another a couple plans to look at. Point four, point two. Ah. Ah. <laughs> Grr. So my scouts are going by here right now, and then we can see their spread here. He's got six point seven and two tech going, huh? Man. Uh, yeah, we can be friends for now. I mean, you did go around and and whoop everyone's ass last time, so I assume you'll probably be more effective now that uh, now that um now that it is on normal. I do say so, but I think my video is running a bit long here, so I'm gonna go ahead and and uh. Pause it, and I will see you guys in the next one, so take it easy.